DJ Lil King, you know what I'm saying? This was like, nigga, we was on that banging shit for real. No, you know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, like, yeah. nigga, we were first generation. Yeah, you know what yeah. I'm saying? So how does that start? Like the NSB type, I mean, uh, the uh, Northside Bomb Squad. Like, how does that end up starting? Just on man. Is that when y'all in uh, junior high school? Y'all started no, kind of no, like we were, high we're in high school. That was that was at, that was at Miller. Man. And was that more of just like what was that like some like rappers? Boys. Was it we're, some street niggas? Like what? Was like see, this what this is what this is what like really man. It was a, we had a song called NSBS. Oh really? You know what I'm saying? It. Richard was by himself. I had a uh, I had a partner named my my relative Storm. You know what I'm saying? And me and Baron, we were the deaf MCs. You know what I'm saying? Me and Baron were the deaf MCs. But we had a song called NSBS, North Side Bomb Squad. That was the click. Yeah. That was our click. You know what I'm saying? It, uh, nigga, we wasn't like, like I say, everybody poor, bro. Nigga, we trade, we share clothes, nigga. We share shirts, nigga. We share shoes, nigga. The only thing we ain't sharing is drawers and socks, nigga. <laughs> Hell yeah. We yeah. eat over here. We eat over there. A nigga spend the night over yeah. here. A nigga mama getting beat. He don't know what the fuck to do. You come spend the night yeah. over here. Yeah, yeah. Nigga, I'm talking about nigga with this 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 little brotherhood was for real, dog. I'm talking about that motherfucking real, my nigga. This little brother this little this little brotherhood was real. And that's how that shit started. It was, we ain't never like depicted this shit to be no motherfucking game, but like that's what it eventually boiled it boiled down into. Look, it was a it was a crib nigga named Papa G. Came from uh California. He owned some property in Hillcrest. He was like an old nigga who was around y'all. He, he was no, nah, he was older than us. Okay. He was a few years older than us. Man. Already. Yeah, and he owned some property in Hillcrest, man. And uh he took a liking to us, right? He took a liking to us. And uh one day I think it was Jim Lee and Ernie Hope was slap boxing. It was one night. We was in the Northside Mountain. It was slap boxing. That slap boxing hard, but that's how we played. You yeah. know what I'm saying? That nigga popped his trunk and tried to give Jim Lee the, uh, the Uzi. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> and Baron was like, no, nah, nigga, what is you doing? You tripping, nigga. Like, yeah. no, nah, what is you doing? Like, nigga, nigga what's, he was like, nigga, what's, what's up with that shit? Because I, yeah. I think he knew, because I think he was familiar with Ernie, but not Jim Lee. He was familiar with Ernie, not Jim Lee. You know what I'm saying? And uh, like, nah, man, that, that's that's the, that's the homeboy. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, so the nigga wanted us to uh become Crips. You know what I'm saying? It was like, it was like, nah, we don't do that over here, bro. It's an SBS. Ain't nobody banging. Ain't no colors flying over here. We used to wear black and gray. Already. We had black and gray flags. Like, ain't no other colors flying over here. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I mean, that was like, nigga was saying, ain't no other colors flying over here. You know what I'm saying? But that's what it was. Yeah. We're like, we're like, no, 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 we ain't banging nothing over. We ain't doing nobody else shit. You know what I'm saying? This, this yeah. is us. You know what I'm saying? And that's what we, that's what we were just, we're just a little, little group of niggas. You know what I'm saying? That was, that was really like, that was really like brothers. Brother, I, I was, I played varsity football, bro. I'd be on the football field with my flag on. Oh, shit. Real shit. Wrap, fly down my neck. <laughs> on kickoff. <laughs> God you know damn. what I'm Yeah, this nigga, this is this is factual. Actual factuals, nigga. God yeah. Damn. But but that's what it that's what it was. And man, and we kinda we 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 stuck to the script until, you know, when 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 brothers started getting into the game of things, yeah. you know what I'm saying? The game, that's when we kinda start going our ways, you know what I'm Not saying? Really. But uh but for the most part, man. It wasn't. It wasn't none of that shit. It wasn't none of that shit. It wasn't none of that shit. Shit. We made a. We made a crib nigga ride. At that time, yes. Yeah, swear to God, he came down. I won't say a nigga name shit like that, but he had came down here. You know what I'm saying? Them niggas with that nigga. That nigga used to talk that Hoover. That Hoover shit at that time. You know what I'm saying? And uh, they uh, they uh, shit. Them niggas used to whip that nigga ass every day until that nigga rode. You know what I'm saying? He. he so he was riding with us, you know yeah. what I'm saying? It was, it was, and it wasn't even the fact that they were just like, bro, we, you're not gonna do that over here. Hell yeah. You're not, you're not gonna be, you ain't gonna come out the house and you with all that shit. Yeah, hell all yeah. That. It wasn't gonna be none of that, you know what I'm saying? And you know they they had a uh, they had a they had a they had a news report. It was, we made the news and everything. It was talking about the games in Corpus Christi. You know what I'm saying? Talking yeah. about it. You know we made. This, this this little set here made the news. Uh, you know yeah. what I'm saying? As the the most official one. Oh, you know really? what I'm saying? Cause like, bro, it was like, it was like this, bro. Like, 
they be like, that's in SBS. Kids be like, we're in SBS. The Damn. Young Bucks. Okay. I you know what I'm saying? Yeah, and and yeah. you ain't you ain't even official or nothing, but you just you just got it. You just you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like just, like nigga, they gon' they gonna rep this north side. Yeah, yeah. They're gonna yeah. rep it. You know what I'm saying? This 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 part of town, like for real. Hell yeah. They're gonna rep it. You know what I'm saying? So it it was it was it it was it was like that. It was like that. Like I, I one time Hill Crescent, like Hill, I think Hill Crescent and the projects really did. One time, man, and I don't think everybody remember this, man. One time, like, it, what was that? What was that? It was a club. I think it was called Body Rock on the west side. It, 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 it Hill Crest and, and North Side niggas got into a fight with some inferior niggas. And ever since that day, bro, it was just like. It was like we was all like officially this is north side. Oh really? Like if we say what side of town. Yeah. Like the north. You know okay, what I'm okay, bet. It's still <clears throat> north side manor. In it's Hill still Gen Leather. Already in Hill Creek, all that. It's still cause I re- I rep I rep a street in each mother each one of the motherfuckers. I stayed on them hoes. <laughs> oh, I stayed yeah. I stayed nigga, I stayed on Hubbard, I stayed on Town in New Aces, nigga, and I and I stayed on Chapito, nigga, and I and them my streets. Oh, really? You know what I'm saying? So <clears throat> so yeah. And uh, I think I think for me for myself for myself when I first should have seen it like the side was like yeah we all really good like we was all fucking with each other because a lot of us was really fucking with each other but it was just you know we still had that kind of like little edge to a nigga oh them north side niggas them yeah, hell niggas, yeah. shit like that hell you know yeah. what I'm saying but <clears throat> I always had I always had a good a little a little love, a lot a lot of love from niggas from uh from from the crest because I think I established that relationship by going to house yeah and hell yeah hell you know yeah. what I'm saying and. And and walking walking through the community through, during the daytime <laughs> God damn. With, some, with, with more than two or three niggas, you know uh, what I'm really? saying? Okay, do you remember like any like big shows coming to Corpus like back in the day, opening up for any shows that big talent that came to Corpus, anything like that? Like for me, the the first. Big show like when Bear, Bear, my partners got locked up, right? They wound up doing some things and wound up getting locked up. So when it it was left, the rap so the rapping was left with me and Richard, my essay partner. You know what I'm saying? It was me and him. And Habo G used to be our manager. Mm. Habo G used to be our manager. They had this card, bro, with 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 sex fiends. Uh, uh, man, Sex Fiends, UGK. It was like, it was like, it was like, bro, it was like about nine dudes. UGK was the, the headline, right? Habo G, the day of the show, Habo G went there. You talking to the mic over there? Shit. Yeah, my bad, my bad. The, the, the day of the headline, the day, the day of the show, Habo G went there and, and begged them dudes, say, man, let me play this tape for you. Just let me play this tape. Five minutes. I mean, give me five minutes of your time or something like that, man. When, when, uh, when old boy heard that tape, we were the second to the last. He put us before. I say all these dudes. This is like when when rapping start coming out of Houston. You know yeah. what I'm saying? The Ghetto Boys was already out, but this is when everybody started following suit. You know what I'm saying? Choice and all these. You know what I'm saying? These females, Choice and all, all these uh, other rappers, man. Yeah, I can't yeah. remember everybody's name because it's so long time ago, and we done been through so many rap, yeah, rap yeah, things. Yeah. But, man, this is like first generation. Like, one of my favorite groups was Sex Fiend. But, uh, but uh, man, they put us... Right before UGK, you know what I'm saying, and, P- and Pimp C actually had an interest in my essay partner. He was like, "Man, who was that messing?" You know what I'm saying. Oh, really? So, we 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 that was that was. As time went by, yeah, and to think who it was, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it, yeah, yeah. Seems, yo, that was that's big for me because they wasn't the UGK who they was basically. Yeah, in and, and later then, years, but check shit. this out, check this out. You know what I'm saying? When I start rapping with Richard and eventually start rapping with Fat Man, you know what I'm saying? Tell us, hold on, before you before you get to the story with, with Fat Man, tell us rapping with Fat Man. 
what the, the beauty pageant story is that before rapping with Fat Man or that's yeah after? no that's way that's way before I was still a, I was still a youngster okay yeah you know I want to tell, tell the beauty pageant story well, you know, <laughs> well my part like I say my partner left and I had to I had to rap by so myself. somebody hit y'all up and say there was a black beauty pageant in Corpus do y'all want to perform type shit or y'all got got just basically got put on yeah okay like that all you right know what I'm saying? well James James King who was a DJ one of the most popular DJs here at the time too like around the hoods and stuff like yeah. that. Yeah. I think he the one who got the show for us. You know what I'm saying? Like, because, like, he was out. I think James was trying to manage us and get us stuff like that. Already. It, uh, they got us on that show. Now, mind you, we go through the back. We don't see, I don't see these people. I don't know who's out there. <laughs> I don't know who out there. Baron really is the nigga. Yeah. Like, I can rap, but this nigga can rap. You know what I'm saying? Chris beatbox, you know what I'm saying? Of course, we got our DJ. I think James is DJing or whatever, whatnot. And uh, and I'm rapping my ass off. Like I said, I do my little two songs and shit, right? Man, when we come from backstage, and you know, we close it out. Oh, really? We close it out. When we come from backstage, bro, and they let us out the, the door. But when I tell you, everybody from school and and motherfuckers ain't knowing they was all right there in the hallway waiting for us like yeah, i like man Creole, we didn't know you rapped out of that say it was yeah. crazy it was crazy man everybody i mean that shit that was wild that shit that was wild and I ain't gonna lie that's when i became popular as a kid oh, really? like i was popular with my like in my neighborhood like in north side manor with yeah. my little partners but i think that moment right there outside of Northside Mountain in that area going on to the west side, yeah. I became popular. Okay, what was you, know you know rapping? What, what was your rap name back then? Kid Creek. Already. God damn. Okay, then you go back uh, to whenever you say you end up linking up with Fat Man and y'all ends up starting rapping, doing music together. What like when in, in Pimp seeing them early 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 stages, man, you know what I'm saying? We would always get he would always call us for a show. Already. When when they came down to perform, he called Fat Man and they'll come get me. Already. You know what I'm saying? So, that 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 was a. Uh, I I eventually had the opportunity to perform with them more than once when they would come down here. You know what I'm Damn. saying? So so that was always that was always a blessing in that. You know what I'm saying? That's before like you know to her to us from day one it was Pimp C. Yeah. You know what I'm yeah. saying? But for the world it was diff it's different. You know what I'm saying? And and this is before it was for the world. Yeah, you know what yeah. I'm saying? So, in the early stages. Yeah, of in the shit. early stages. Yeah, yeah. And what I used to like about then, see, man, the, the, the North was so live, bro. Like, we had a spot called the Players Club, right? And the Players Club had a little stage in there and stuff. And, and, and Big Fred used to bring, like, all the under underground artists there okay. from Houston. Klondike Cats oh, and shit. all these. Just, you know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, man, just everybody... From that little era right like there. Like Point you know, Blanks point and all blank that. Yeah, and all yeah, yeah. Shit. That's where small town killers come from. Because oh, them niggas yeah. were spending time down here. Okay. You know what I'm saying? On the north. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Them niggas were spending time down here. Them niggas actually liked it down here. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Because a nigga kind of get away from the violence and the shit of Houston. And what was the Players Club located in? On the block. Okay. Bad, on, bad. on the block. All right. On the north side where... Well, creases and all that that, that that area for that area on the streets. Yeah, located on the streets. Okay, you know what I'm saying. Okay, okay, okay. Where street. where we used to be lit up at back yeah, in the yeah, day yeah, type yeah, shit. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. Man, hell yeah, on the hell streets yeah. Called the Players Club. Oh, really? You know what I'm saying. Yeah, that's what's up. So we always we always got the for us like that's why like it's crazy like Northside niggas we don't get enthused around them niggas. And I'm talking about like celebrity status type news because yeah. man, at a young age we was already being around these type of individuals like with established relationships or like kind of like friendships or just dealing with these dudes so much on average that they're around that like you know what I'm saying? It is what it is. The niggas still out here getting it too. You know yeah, what I'm yeah. saying? Niggas is still out here getting it too. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah. I never even when like me me and uh, Al was hanging around. You know what I'm saying? Al D was hanging around, and, and uh, I, I had I had the pleasure of being around Screw or, or going to the studio and all these different things with Al. Man, I never felt like I was somewhere beyond me. Already, 
You know what I'm saying? Hell yeah. I've never felt like that. Like, yeah. like man, I, I, I'm from the bottom of the bottom, like for real. I'm from North South Manor, like really, nigga, the bottom of the bottom, nigga. When I got mine, it was meant for me. You dig what I'm saying? When my time came, it was meant for me. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, and yeah. I and ain't never once in my life, nigga, I ain't never thought I wasn't that nigga. Oh, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, and yeah. understand what I'm saying. I'm like, I'm not talking about like in a sense that where I'm arrogant. No, you know no, you saying? just know who ain't, you are. Ain't, 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 ain't yeah. never, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You Hell could right. you could you couldn't say too much. Only thing you could you could you could probably hurt me was when my mama passed away when I was young. You said something about her, that shit would hurt me. But I had grew up with my daddy so much, been with my dad so much, that shit faded away. Nigga, I talk about your mama. Yeah. You know <laughs> what I'm saying? So it yeah. it, 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 it didn't bother me. That shit didn't bother me no more. You know what Hell I'm saying? Yeah. But like, nigga, my auntie, my aunties them always told me I was handsome. You know what I'm saying? Oh, really? I, so, a bitch will be lying. She tell you, nigga, <laughs> you dig what I'm saying? My mama told me, nigga, so you lying, bitch. Your words don't outweigh my mama's words. You know what I'm saying? Hell yeah. So, I ain't never, like, I ain't never had that, that, like, that part of, uh, uh, having to worry type Having to worry about yeah, yeah. shit or just being around individuals and thinking they was bigger than me. I, I'm telling you, bro, yeah. I was more influenced, like, not influenced, but, like, I like the niggas that I, I was around in the hood more than anything else. You know what I'm saying? Oh, because, yeah, nigga, we get it too. Hell yeah. And that was all my, always my mentality. Nigga get it too. Hell yeah. I want to ask that uh, you was talking about uh, Point Blank and like Klondike Cat and them coming like to Corpus back in the day at the Players Club. Uh, on the Small Town song, which you have brought up, Point Blank has a line where he says, uh, he talks about Northside Manor. He says, even when 5 O's bust, niggas bust back. Do you know where that line originates from? Was yeah. there a shootout in Northside Man or something with the laws and somebody back in the day or some shit that you can well, recall well, of that, or some shit? Well, well, that's 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 yeah, nigga, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Growing growing up there, yeah, many times and in, in, in majority of the times it happened in that slab area. Oh, really? You know what I'm saying? Because boys was always able to get away. It, shit, one of my one of one of my partners shot at the law. Damn. I'm talking about shot at that nigga. God you know damn. what I'm saying? And, and he, he would have got away with the shit. That motherfucker ain't say nothing. God damn. But yeah, the nigga shot at the law. <laughs> shit. God like, damn. Like, look, man. Look, man. When when I told like when I told you that that when that crack hit that era that era, when that era came in, you know, shit. It, it 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 created some shit. You know what I'm saying? Like it was it, 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 different type of nigga. Nigga, football, niggas, niggas with aspirations. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Niggas with aspirations. You know what I'm saying? But nigga, hey, college what? Nigga, shit. Who, nigga? What they, what they talking about? Yeah. HBU, HBCU, nigga? What, what was that? <laughs> nigga, the LMNOP, nigga? Shit. Nigga, aspirations, yeah. Right out the window. Nigga, shit. shit. Nigga, yeah, nigga yeah. Shit, man, look. Nigga, you walking around. With two years ago shoes on, yeah. Your brother pants on, hell yeah. My shirt on, shit like that. Look, hell man, yeah. and and you see this shit right here. It ain't got, and you know it ain't, and, and you see it ain't got to be like that. Hell yeah, yeah. Nigga, nigga, throw their dreams away, man. Yeah, po yeah. Poverty, poverty is a motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Shit, yeah. motherfuckers, motherfuckers know, shit. Poverty a motherfucker. Niggas throw their dreams away to 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 feed themselves. You know what I'm saying? Hell thing yeah. about it, one thing about it, it always start off as to feed yourself. Be able to take care of something. But boy, when that shit get to rolling, <laughs> that, that, yeah. that, 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 that's when you, that, that, that's when it, that's when the test of men come. Hell yeah. Cause see, that shit gonna be your testament. <laughs> That's when the testament gonna be your testament. Hell you know yeah. what I'm saying? For real nigga shit. I'm telling you, bro, because this is where a lot of us go to prison. Yeah. This is where a lot of us get killed. Already. You know what I'm Hell saying? Yeah. Hell yeah. Like like real nigga shit, man. Okay, so we go to that then. I got that. That was one of the questions. I was what, what your first time going to prison, like what was your first time going to prison for?